Hi guys, welcome back. I am Sir Drinks a lot, and you are on a Lap It Up drink review series that I enjoy, and hopefully you do too. Today's drink of choice is uh, something special. I've wanted to do this one for a little bit now, and uh, I haven't been able to find it. So on a road trip I went on just recently, I found it in a gas station around the area, and uh, I'm... Uh, Kind of happy about it. Mountain Dew Liberty Brew. I've been seeing um, food reviews, Gun Rail, a couple other places do this. And I want to try. And here I am trying to open it without reading the instructions. I am so excited. <laughs> Limited edition. Ooh, the smell. It's a nice smell. I like that. Um, look at it, 280 calories, um, zero fat. That's 90 milligrams of sodium, 75 grams of carbs, where uh, 75 are for sugars, zero protein. And as always, Mountain Dew Company, we're here to help. It's a PepsiCo company. Please recycle all that fun stuff. Let's get tasty. Ooh. Mm. It's a it's a berry flavor. It's like a let's see if it's labeled here. It's a very sweet. It tastes. It's 50 flavors in one. Ooh. 50 states. Let me get it. <sighs> Oddly, it kind of reminds me of the uh, Blue Push Pop. I mean, not Blue Push Pop, the, the ice, the frozen ice push pop things you get and you put them in the freezer. This is this is this tastes like the blue flavor. I'm not sure what that what that represents. Is it like a blue raspberry or it's very sweet and it has a berry like flavor in my opinion. Um let me get out here. I have a bumpy driveway. <laughs> but yeah, this is a fairly, fairly decent. Yeah. Mm. It's a, it's a neat flavor. Um, very cool, very crisp. I don't get this, the funky aftertaste. You got that Mountain Dew flavor, but there's a, kind of a... It's a little extra sweet. I said it's like a, it's like a, it's like a berry flavor of some kind. And I'm trying to figure out... Oh yeah, this thing's getting loose. With new mounts, you always have to find the right kind of proportion, the right kind of setting for it, <coughs> and uh, this one hangs off the rear view mirror, which I've started to think may not be a great idea, that's an added weight, which I mean, it's, it's super, it's glad, it's like more than super glued, I mean, it's, it's mounted to the glass, so that shouldn't be a problem, but you never know, right? I'm not a big fan of dash mounts. The one that mounts in the grate of the great of the gray sea. Like I kind of like that because well I mean this, phones always get so hot. They're right in front of the mirror. If you're gonna put them in something like that, it causes an issue. So you want it away from like direct sunlight because it's gonna be sitting there for hours. Um, but 
they don't hold up, especially with the bigger phones. So you have to get something that almost would hold a tablet. Um, this bracket thing is really kind of neat, but that's all like I said. That's a lot of weight to put on your. Uh, Good blend. I don't know. I'm not sure. He said it does kind of. It does kind of taste like the blue icicle pops, pop ice, which you can get. I always like blue. Blue is always, blue is always one of my favorites. Not my all all time favorite, but definitely blue. I, I did I did like a lot. Um, actually, I don't think there's any single pop ice that I ever really hated. Oh, wait, look at me. I hate this kid. Um. It's, it's, a, it's a good flavor. You guys should try it. If you can get it in your area, give it a shot. Tell me what you think. This is a pretty good flavor. I, I really, I'm really liking this. In fact, if I were to see it again, I might buy it just to drink it. Carbonation is just right. Like I said, no funky aftertaste. Yeah, I think, uh, I think Mountain Dew did it good. Way to go, guys. <laughs> Anyway, I hope you all are doing well. I am Sir Drinks and Lunch. Oh, wait, no, I forgot to grade the dang thing. Uh, let's see. I'll go ahead, I, I would give it a five on the five scale. I'll go ahead and give it an eight. Yeah, I'm going to give it an eight. Considering the amount of really good drinks, this thing's up there. I have it in my fridge. I don't think I drink it every day, but definitely, this is a, almost kind of a movie drink, too. It's something you should drink during a movie, you know? Yeah, it's got the lobby kind of business. Yeah. Anyway, sunshine. I'll catch you guys in the next one. I love you. I hope you're all doing well. I'm wishing you health, wealth, and love with enough time and gusto to enjoy it all down to the last drop.